Where are we dropping, boys? Jimbro Beach? Maybe Y2K Woods? Um, ooh, we should go to Frat Bro Fields. I haven't been there in so long. No, we decided that we're going to be going somewhere a little different today. Somewhere we haven't been yet. Oh, really? Where? Today, we're going to be landing Edgar Estate. <gasps> Edgar Estate? No, you're joking, right? Please tell me you're joking. You know what they would do to me in a place like that? With how, how I'm looking right now? You don't want to know what would happen if I dropped the soap. Bro, please tell me we're not going there. Hello? Can you hear me? Bro, say something. No gamma, no gamma, no gamma, no gamma, really, nigga. Gamma, no gamma. Before you spawn in, there's a little something you go through called champ select. Basically, you can select any character you want. Your build, the different stats, the different abilities and skill lists that you have. You can even choose your skin. Once you confirm everything from there, you hit the loading screen. But IRL works a little differently. You don't get to select what skin you want or what your ultimate is. You simply just get what you get. Your build and your stats are all randomized. It's like they just randomly pulled tickets out of a hat and put them all together. It's literally like they just spun a wheel and somehow landed on Edgar. Wow. Edgar, Edgar, Edgar. Today we're going to be going over the underrated art of how to become an Edgar. All things Edgar. Edgar 101. So get your pen and paper ready so that you can become the world's next top Edgar. Edgar World. Edgar Estate. Edgar Industries. Okay, so I'm going to be breaking it down into three things. Because everyone knows that's how you're supposed to do these things. It's like if you're writing an essay, you have three body paragraphs. But y'all wouldn't know that because you're too busy procrastinating when you have those assignments to That's right. Everyone knows that when you have a tree map, you got to have three things. Any more just looks weird. The cut, the fit, and the tendencies. Starting off with the cut, which is quite literally the most important part of the operation. If this is a GTA mission, then the cut is the setup. And you can be a real player, just like me. <laughs> because you can't do the heist without the missions first. For the cut, I would say that you're going to want to go to those IG barbers. But actually for this one, you're going to want to go to the local homie who thinks he's an IG barber. Not an actual barber. Now the local homie will probably do you wrong, but it's just a risk you got to take. It's either the local barber homie or the high school bathroom barber. One of the two. What's up YouTube, it's Mario Blends back at again with another video. Either way, you just gotta do what you gotta do. Go to the local homie and tell him to give you the fluffy, messy Edgar. And he'll get you right. The fluffy, messy Edgar is the wave. Do not be getting the normal Edgar. Cause you're going for max prestige Edgar here. The cut's honestly just pretty simple. Just get like a little low taper with, with a lineup or something. Just like a little burst fade or something. For the fit, Tommy Hilfiger and True Religion are gonna be your best friends. For the fit, it's a little simple. All you need is a plain white tee, a plain black tee, and then when you're feeling when you're feeling good, when you want to pop out a little bit, maybe stunt, get yourself a red tee, maybe a polo or two, and then a black zip-up hoodie. But if you're trying to be max prestige Edgar, what you can do is substitute the black zip-up for a black skeleton zip-up. Mmm, that's what we like to see. For pants, just get some of these jeans. These are the ones you want. You're gonna want to be getting the light wash version of these. Make sure this is how they fit too. And then also just some cargo pants. For shoes, just get some white forces. Uh, occasionally you could go with black. And then get some Jordan 4s. All the people who used to wear like the old school checkered vans, oh the red ones. God. If you used to wear the red ones, this is you now. That was like five years ago and now you've evolved into this. Then get like a fitted cap, black or blue, maybe red, but black or blue are the go-tos. The LA fitted cap is essential for this. And then like a studded belt, little BB belt or something. Doesn't matter if it's fake or not. And then some studded earrings. And then that completes the fit. That is all you need. But you can't just have the fit and not play the part. The tendencies are essential for putting this all together. The tendencies are just like how rappers have their signature ad-libs. Like Playboy Cardi wouldn't be Playboy Cardi without- <laughs> What? So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is be late to class cause you were vaping in the high school bathroom. Then when school gets out, you're gonna wanna be taking fit pics with your car. 
take them like this these poses these stances are essential these are a must you're gonna want to post them on instagram captioning it something like this something like they sleeping on me blah 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 or like a song quote or something something after you're done with that, if you live in LA, you gotta hit up Knott's. Knott's Berry Farm, that's the place to be. The golden ticket for this mission. Slide to Knott's Berry Farm with the shorties and turn up. On the way there, you're gonna be wanting to put some Bay Area music on the off. Something like this. Some like Mike Sherm or Shoreline Mafia. Maybe... Maybe Drake of the Ruler, some, something to turn up to. Once you're almost done at Knott's, you're gonna wanna go on Snapchat, go to the stories, click on them and just swipe swipe through and keep on the lookout for stories that look like this look for the ones that say op swipe up for the addy byoe byob girls free guys five dollars ten dollars after nine when you find that one swipe up and head over and when you get there there's only one last thing that you need to do one final part of the heist just go find yourself a short latina once you've done all that, you've officially graduated from Edgar Academy. You're a true Edgar now. Congratulations. There's no going back. Thanks for watching. Bye.